Hey everyone, I'm Erica. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a logo for free. This is a complete beginner's guide. I'm also going to be showing you how you can upload the logo to your blog. Let's get started guys. So just before we begin, if you guys don't know what a logo is, this is my sad edition of a logo. It's really funny and I'm sure you guys can do better than this. Anyway, so we need to find the uh, dimensions that you have to use for your logo and to find your dimensions you can go ahead to your dashboard just scroll down to where it says appearance and you want to select customize now every theme is not the same your theme might not have the same uh sections as my theme does but what you want to look for is just go into the, anywhere that says general settings tab you want to click on that and you want to look for site logo tagline and title click on that as well and this is the first option is your logo option now yours is not going to look like this if you don't have a logo installed already it's going to say upload a logo so i'm going to change the logo because we want to find the dimensions and this is what we're looking for we're looking for the custody dimensions for that uh, particular image so we're going to be using 300 by 62 pixels and you just want to mark that down because we are going to be using a site called canva canva.com is a free site that you can use to create graphics you just go ahead and create a free account and once you're on your dashboard you want to use the custom dimensions and in here you can add the 600 by 62 pixels and go ahead and click on design now there is another free site and it's called um, burner.bonanza.com and i'm gonna leave that in the description below now this is for removing a uh, white backgrounds to make your images have a transparent background if you don't have photoshop i usually use photoshop to uh, create my uh, images next there is another free site that is called uh, freelocaldesign.org you can use that as well to create your logo and with this site you can you can create the logo on here and you can download to your computer it's going to have a transparent background and it's all free all you need to do is sign up and put in your email address and you will be good to go you can create your logo here so let's say we want to go ahead and create a logo using this particular site so you just want to scroll down to where it says create my logo and we're going to wait a little bit until this opens up i have not used this uh before but i was looking for a tool that you guys can use to make it easier for you to create your logos and i found this site on google so let's say i want to go ahead and choose a logo from here that we can use we can um we can go ahead and change it to how we want it to be we can customize it to how we want it to be okay i'm not seeing anything on here let's go for business and consulting or computer you just want to look for something in your niche and you can go ahead and customize it just as you want it so let's say i just selected this one for the sake of this tutorial and once we're gonna wait click on that and wait a little bit until it opens up so whenever you want to uh, edit a section you can go ahead and just select that section or i think you have to come up here and use these four boxes at the right of your screen so you can add text and this is where you have the option to put in your text so i'm going to put in there start a mommy blog okay so that is my text you can use this to add a color to your just select that okay and you can drag this wherever you want to put it so let's say i want to delete that section yes i want to delete that and i want to add the start a mommy blog on a under that and next you want to change your shape you can go ahead and delete that particular shape just delete that yes you want to delete that as well you want to delete that one and you can go ahead and add your own shape in there so let's say you want to drag this down 
now we we're not using um, our custom dimensions on here that was for canvas so you can go ahead and choose a shape from in here okay let's say you want to go ahead and choose either of these shapes um let's go with that one you can choose go ahead and see other options as well okay I'm gonna go with this one and I'm gonna just select that and click on add okay and let's see the preview okay there it is so you can go ahead and add that and you can also remove this if you like you just go and delete that delete that delete that one as well yes so I'm trying to make this as fast as I can okay now you can also add a color to that shape okay now I think I'm done and once you're done you just want to click the preview tab and it's going to open it up to where you can download the um, logo itself now this is all you're working on a transparent background I think so now that you've uh, gone ahead and finished up your logo you can go ahead and download it for free so once you click on the download for free they're gonna request that you add your first name and your email address and they're gonna send you a link that you can use to go ahead and download your logo so I've already done that and I created a logo with this and I uploaded it to the site so here it is I just tried that for the sake of this tutorial and you can use that platform as well I'm gonna leave a link below that you can use to create your logo over there so next is with canva now you have canva I'm just gonna drop this background just so you can see what you what uh, size of a canvas that you can work with now we're not gonna need that I'm gonna delete that it's not working because my connection is slow anyway okay so let me just click on that and remove that I want to remove that yep remove the elements so with canva you can choose logos let's say we want to go you have a lot of free logos on here that you can choose to use for your site as well but you this is why you need to have in a tool that you can use to remove backgrounds because with canva they come with a white background but with the site that I showed I showed you guys they come with uh, a transparent background so let's say I want to go with this one just want to drop that in there and you want to scale it to the size of your okay just want to get that to that size and you can add a text as well gonna add a little text just want to go ahead and add a little text okay I'm gonna leave that to the initials of my blog and I want to go ahead and change the colors let's say I want to go with gray Nah, that looks anyway I'm just gonna leave it as that for the sake of this tutorial and yeah I'm gonna drag that so okay now you just make sure that you download this in a PNG format you just download that to your computer you want to na name it as well so that you can find it when you're about to upload it to your site so I've downloaded the um, let's go ahead and upload it to the blog so we're gonna go back in the customize uh, section and I just want to change the logo so once you select change the logo or upload a logo you can go ahead and just click the upload files select the file and this is gonna take me to my computer where I can find the file okay there is the file open that up and just wait until that loads go ahead and select it you're gonna have an option in here to crop the image as well just until that loads so here it is okay 
gonna crop it this is gonna be one small logo so let's go ahead and finish cropping up the image and there it is so you need to click the save and publish now we're gonna go check out the blog and see if we've added the logo successfully there it is we have a new logo so this is how you create your logo with canva and you can also use this site that i showed you guys to remove your backgrounds so i didn't show you guys how you can how you can use this site you want to go ahead and choose a photo and we're going to use that same logo that we just created she's going to upload that we're going to upload the photo and we just want to remove the background. Okay. It is removing the white background and there it is. So next you've selected that one. Yep. You just select that. And once you're done, they're going to tell you that you need to log in to, to download as well. Just click on login and you would be able to log in with Facebook or Google+. You can click either of these and you could go ahead and download the uh, logo with a transparent background. So I hope this uh, tutorial helped. And as you can see, I have successfully created the world most beautiful logo and you can go ahead and do the same so if you have any questions please leave them below and i am going to get back to you as soon as i can you guys have an awesome night